we're always asked about where I put my snow bungee stuff on my sled. Every sled's different. You've got different space to use. Think about what you've got to work with and, and come up with a method to do it. I always like to find a place to put my snow bungee pulling tools to where I can get them quickly and put them back. If I've got to dig into a pack or under a seat or under a hood or something like that, I'm not as apt to grab them and, and use them. My rattler, what I've done on my sled is uh, add some straps with buckles that I just came up with and uh, my Cobra. I've uh, put a uh, link in over here into my strap that I had over on my gas can. can. And what I do is uh, when I want my Cobra, I just unsnap these two buckles. And I've got the Cobra off that quick. Go back again, I, I hook them back into these hooks. Secure a little rubber strap on there so the hook doesn't come off. Fasten the buckles back again. Like I said, every sled's different. You just need to think about what you've got to work with. Find a place to do it. My rattler, I've done basically the same thing. I've got a strap here that I hook into the handle. So to get my rattler, it's just that quick. Take it off and put it back on again. If you have these tools out like this where you can get to them, you'll use them more often and save yourself a lot of work during the day. If you've got them buried in a bag or something, you've got to dig through all of that and put it back. So this is just some ideas that I've got. Look at your slide, think about what you can do, and uh, come up with a method.